I've been in London for about a week now. This isn't my first time here, but something that I've noticed so much more this trip that I didn't notice before, my British friends. You guys are so polite. And this is what I mean. So I'm in London to record my audiobook of my book. First day, I go to the studio. I meet the whole team at the audio studio. There was two gentlemen. There was Ben, and then there was another man named Toby. Now, remembering names, not my strong suit. Gonna be so real with you, not my strong suit. I met them both on the first day. I was recording with Toby. However, for the entire first day, I was convinced this man's name was Ben. I'm talking like, I'm knocking on the door. I'm like chit chatting with him. I'm like, we're getting along so great. Like Ben, hey Ben, like Ben, ha ha ha. I am literally like calling this man Ben. I go so far as to find a shop next door that is called Ben's Cookies and I got him a cookie being like, Ben, look, it's you, Ben's Cookies. The thing is though, he responded. He responded to everything. Like knock on the window and be like, Ben. And he'd be like, yeah. I got him that cookie being like, look, it's you. And he was like, thank you, yeah. Like he, I think he was convinced his name was Ben too. Anyway, day two, my publisher comes and joins us. Toby Ben is not there, but Ben Ben is there. And Ben Ben introduces himself to my publisher as Ben. I have called this other man Ben the whole day. Eventually, Toby Ben walks in. Immediately, I'm like, why did you not tell me your name was Toby? Why did you let me call you Ben the whole day? He plays it off, perfect English gentleman. No, I didn't even notice. Bullshit, yes you did. And since then, I have just noticed it in so many other interactions with my British friends here. Just very, very polite, very polite. I don't know, maybe I'm the only one noticing this? Am I crazy? Y'all are just so polite. Anyway, I love you guys, y'all are great. I love it here. <laughs>